Hi beauties, it's Jean with Beauty and the Stamper. And I was wondering, do you have these little wallflowers that they've all run out? Well, I have learned how to um, change them out. So there's nothing in here. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some scissors and I'm gonna grab that plastic piece. And I'm just gonna see how my scissors fit in there. Once I work that out, I'm gonna stick this little guy and I'm not gonna cut down, I'm just using this to hold. You could also use some like pliers or whatever you'd like. This does take a little while because I don't wanna ruin anything. And I'm just gonna get a little cup here to go ahead and stick that in because there was um, some essential oils in here, right? So I also got some uh, unstoppables from the Dollar Tree. So quick and easy. I have these little containers also from the Dollar Tree. And rather than having these go all over the place, I'm gonna just pour them right in here so that I can keep them for later as well. I have a little eyedropper and these are to fill gummies. And I'm gonna try without having to put them in one by one. You could probably create a little funnel to do this much easier, but you're gonna put those unstoppables right in here. I already know an easier way. I can use a um, I could use that Stampin' Up embossing, and that would go in there rather well. But I'm just gonna do this real quick because I want to do this quickly and easily. And this is such a, I thought I dropped one. This is a, such a quick and easy way to get a great smell in there. So I'm gonna feel it. Um, it, it looks like it's halfway, but it's not because this is much bigger than this smaller end. So I'm gonna fill it to about there. And then I'm gonna take my water. You could use warm water if you'd like. Uh, I'm just using regular water. Uh, right from the tap and we're gonna fill that up you could also use some essential oils if you'd like to do that um, you just wouldn't put the water in there so I'm just filling that up and I think we're about good because you need to leave room for the um, wick to go back in there. So now you're going to take that wick and stick that back in there and you are going to push that right back down. I am not strong enough so I'm going to use this guy again. This time I'm going from the top and I still need to hold it. There we go. And now it's back in there and you can see it's already dissolving in there and making a nice uh, little um, uh, what would it be? Concoction for the wick to pull up. Oh, I could smell it already. And then you're just going to pop this right back in there. Oh, I always do it the wrong way. That's the thing about the Bath and Body Works. So it's always different. But you can see it's already starting to go. And I am going to wait until it is fully dissolved in there before I plug that in. So I hope you guys like this. I have done this before. I love it. The smell is great. And look how many times I could refill it. I mean, that didn't take anything at all. So save those. And then when it runs out, you could refill it again. And you could see this is already starting to turn. So, all right, beauties. I hope you have a great day and I will talk to you later. Bye.